MS is an inflammatory condition mm -hmm. where uh, cells that cause inflammation come out of the blood into the brain and attack the myelin and the cells that form myelin which are called oligodendrocytes. Mm -hmm. Now the consequence of that is that the myelin sheath that surrounds individual nerve fibers in the brain is destroyed. Now the, that in turn causes problems with the conduction of nerve impulses along the nerve fibre and so you get the symptoms of a, of a relapse of MS. But then gradually over the next few days and weeks the inflammation will subside and you get a remission. Now, the, But it's important to realise that the remission occurs before the myelin is reformed. Early on in the course of the disease, we know that the myelin that has been damaged will reform quite normally. And so early on, somebody who has an acute relapse, if you looked some months later, you would find it very difficult to see that there was actually any damage at all in their nervous system. But gradually, as time goes by, the repair process starts to fail and you start to get axons or nerve fibers which are no longer surrounded by myelin sheaths.